Hello, what is going on guys? Fluent here and today it is time that I brought you guys another item showcase. So just a quick note before we reveal what item we're showcasing today. We are currently holding a CSGO giveaway on the channel. If you guys would like to enter and you haven't already entered, you can click the video link in the description. This will redirect you to the giveaway video on my channel and then listen to me in the video as I explain how to enter the giveaway. But my friends, enough of me talking rubbish. Let's reveal the item we're showcasing today. So the item we're showcasing today is this. The bayonet fade in factory new condition with a float of 0.061. So before we talk about the knife in more detail, let me just remind you I did say a float of 0.061, which is terrible for a factory new knife. But my friends, something is very, very rare about this knife that I will tell you guys about in a bit. But for now, as we are inspecting the knife in game, as you can see, there's quite a few scratches on the side of the knife that are quite visible. This of course makes the knife look a little bit rubbish but apart from the scratches this knife is still absolutely insane and I will tell you the reason why. Now some of you that do know quite a lot about CSGO skins might have already noticed what else is rare about this knife but for you guys that haven't noticed this bayonet fade is actually a 99.2% fade which makes this knife a lot more expensive. Now for you guys that don't know on every fade knife you get a percentage of fade. The lowest percent fade you can get on a knife I believe is 78% and the highest percent fade you can get on a knife is 100 but most of the fade knives if they're above 95% fade you should normally be expecting overpay. Obviously the higher percent the more expensive so if any of you guys have any fade knives and the fade is above 95% let me know in the comment section as I can give you a good price check on your knife. But my friends back to the showcase my bayonet fade is of course a 99% fade. CS.Money are currently offering me an extra £220 overpay just for the pattern itself, which means I can get an extra £225 on top of the original price for the knife, which is of course amazing news. Now moving on to the final part of the showcase where I explain how I acquired this knife. Now this story is a little bit more interesting than the Butterfly Knife Crimson Web story. If you haven't seen that showcase, the link is down below in the description. But for you guys that are interested on how I acquired this knife, let me explain. So about three weeks ago on the 4th of November, I was trying to get some good deals on Skinport. I was looking through a few knives that I was interested in until I come across this absolute beauty. Lo and behold, the bayonet fade. Now this item was listed for £370, which does sound a lot of money, but this item was already discounted by 20% as the default price of the knife was about £400. £150. As soon as I saw the flow, I was tempted to turn away, but then I looked up and saw the 99% fade above the flow, and then all I did was inspect the knife in game, and as soon as I saw the amazing fade pattern on the knife, I instantly purchased this item and made it mine. Now I did try to resell the knife on my Skinport store. I listed it for £550, which was a very good price as I was only asking for £100 over market price. I had it listed for a full week and no one decided to buy it so I decided to withdraw the knife to the legendary inventory of Fluent and five minutes later I opened CSGO and there it was in my inventory. So unfortunately my friends that wraps up the showcase so if you guys have enjoyed this video go ahead and drop a like. If you've enjoyed your boy Fluent showcasing his bayonet fade with a 99% fade personally go subscribe stay alive everybody but for now guys boy. Oh.